feel pretty spoiled because our pilot said yesterday was some of the prettiest weather he had ever seen. No wind, the water was glass. It was absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's definitely not my expectations when I came to Alaska. You just assume it's gonna rain the whole time. So I'm pretty spoiled by that and uh, we're expecting rain the rest of the time and I'm fine with that. I'm just happy to be here. Yeah, we're up here in South Central Alaska. My good friend Larry drew a mountain goat tag up here as well as Jessica Byers. So we thought, why not go on a two-on-one hunt with the very best Alaska guide you've ever seen. And we called him, he wasn't available. So they got me. <laughs> Butterflies. I feel like I've been waiting for so long for this. I think we need about 10 degrees of warmth to lift the cloud level so we can see the goats and then go kill the goats. Right now, it's hard to do much. But at least it's not windy and at least it's not raining. Word. <laughs> right. It's, it's not right now. No. <laughs> it will be. It will be. How you doing, Larry? Good. Yeah? I'm having a good day. Nice and warm, my puffy. Yep, it's all good. One thing I've learned is that it's not always about the quality of calories or the content of your snacks. It's just about the fact that they taste good. <laughs> and you're excited to eat them. Because you got to stay, stay well fed up here. Screw the calories, I want <laughs> chips. I know it. Welcome to another goat video of Brady Munching. Oh, <laughs> this side's good. I can see the ocean. This side, no good. I can see nothing. What do you think about bombing up to that saddle real quick? Yeah, might be a good idea. Take a look. Do have something. to bring our bring our clothes though because we have to wait a while for it to clear. Over here we have more clouds. But they're different. They're different clouds. Well, these clouds look bigger. It's okay. The goats are gonna walk right under us. The fog lifted for enough time for Austin to spot a nanny and a kid down by that snow patch down there. It's not what we're looking for. But it's nice to see a goat. <laughs> I'm not gonna complain about that. got these new binoculars but they kind of suck at distance <laughs> everything's foggy <laughs> it's a shot in the dark but maybe if we drop down to this first saddle we can see just barely under get lucky
Where's the ghost, Larry? <laughs> I don't know. We need to find the ghost. Been a little cloudy. I have to start hiking out. No goats. No go. Headed home. Sad face. 600 feet back up. 600 feet back down. Then we're at camp. <laughs> I think we should move camp. I don't know, they're in the clouds. So we're gonna do it tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow will be better. There's just not enough visibility to know where to go. Don't wanna burn all our energy tromping around in the fog. Saw some nannies with kids and one Billy a long ways away. <laughs> a long ways. <laughs> tomorrow. tomorrow. I think moving camp's gonna help us. last night. Let's go. Did you really? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go kill some goats. Okay. Today's already a better day. The fact that we can see. But I want to make a move. I don't want to wait around too long. Super protected here, but it's protected enough. It's close to water. Leave camp here so we can go light over to the mountain. We want to hunt. I think, given the weather, that's a good option. What's it looking like for the next two days? It's looking scary. We got a six mile an hour wind, nine mile, 10, 11, 12, 15, 17. Two inches of rain tomorrow, 100% chance. Hmm. Think this will flood here with two inches of rain? So what, what does it show tomorrow? Two inches of rain. Oh. That means we're staying somewhere dry. Yeah. Billy, 
just over this hillside right before clouds came in. <laughs> right across that. It's mean, all white. <laughs> mean, nasty valley, and now I can't see it. Austin's considering his life decision. Mm -hmm. Considering your life decision. Future tense. species if needed. <laughs> So foggy, I could, we couldn't really see him very clear, um, and I couldn't get a read on him. So eventually, lifted his head, saw us, and spooked off. We chased him around, trying to get another shot. No luck. Back to mountain goats. Country's too big. <laughs> We're all at the top. Two days ago, everything was hanging out kind of low. Now they're right at the cloud line. We're just looking at that snow, seeing if we can climb up that. There's some sketchy stuff. I'm not even sure if we can get down this until I get on that. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Yeah, it was backwards. Quite a way. Not a bad little home. Yeah. Time. This is a good type setup. Nice windbreak. Rain all around. And when you're thirsty, just open your mouth. <laughs> Drink fresh rainwater. Just a gear frenzy going on here. Oh, hell frantic. Five, six thousand dollars worth of gear. We should be able to survive. A little bit of rain. Don't fail me while I'm dressing. He's like, only film me when I'm undressing. Yeah. <laughs> Just get to my pants down now. <laughs> God. Weather's not good. Just not check. Good. It's bad. Too wet for the big camera, I think. <laughs> we sat under the tarp for a good two hours, and believe it or not, we didn't see a goat, so <laughs> I think it's time to head home. It's getting late. We're getting cold. Oh, you see that goat over there? Where? Right there. Hey, maybe he'll hang out there for us tomorrow. Yeah, maybe. If we ever get out of our tents. Looks like a nice building. Is it? Better at four to six hundred. We don't know. You can't range find in this crap. But uh, he's in a recoverable spot, so we'll see if he stays there till tomorrow. See if we uh, wash away tonight. <laughs> Dude, it is wet. This is rain. Yeah. You saw how much water was over there in that drainage? Drop, running down. Yeah. Crazy. How is it over there? Yeah, baby. Yeah, bull. Everything else is underwater. Here it's floated all the way up past Brady's tent. It did? Yeah, his tent looks like fairy. Just missed it. Well, we almost picked a good spot. Trying to figure out where the water was going to puddle up. Brady's just clear of the river. These next two tents are kind of on the verge. We got a little bit of a water situation going on down here. <laughs> Put that on your side, Are we surviving or are we hunting? We're shivering and surviving. Mike's broke too, so we might have bad audio for the rest of this video. Just hanging out in the tent.
the sun just poked out. Yep. Austin, are we doing this? Let's do it. This is what it's gonna get, baby. I think that's true. It is go time. Okay. One good thing about weather like this, Brady, I doubt anybody else is gonna come up here with us and screw up our hunt. <laughs> that has not been a concern of mine this entire trip. <laughs> So I took a little bit of a tumble yesterday. What day is it? I don't know. Two, two days ago, I was side hilling across this pretty steep face. Took a tumble, rolled over on top of my bow. We shot it. It's a foot low at less than 40 yards. So um, we are now gun hunting. I'm not that mad about it uh, because we're on day four, five. Yeah, we're losing time, so I'll gladly pick up a rifle and I'll be thankful to get a shot at anything at this point. No, we just need to go kill a goat, Larry. Yeah, let's go. Of course, it's got to rain on us, too. To the right quite a ways. He's yeah. hiding behind that rock now. Where is he? He's coming left now. There he is, there he is. There he is. Yeah. He's okay, moving we to stop Larry and put it right on his freaking tail. We gotta readjust. We gotta lift this all up. I'm so far. Yeah. 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 Well, the wind's blowing. It's probably blowing hard up there. How far is he now up there? Nine. Nine hundred? They're all gonna leave the mountain now. I will. Mm -hmm. See that one's going. Oh, that one is going. Tried. There's too much crosswind to predict. <clears throat> Tough to see impacts in the brush. I don't know. I shot a couple times and 
he spooked, but not real hard, and he's just kind of side hilling through the ledges. So we've got another billy up higher embedded in the cliffs. Two of them, actually. Of course, they're scared now, but it wasn't too loud with the suppressor. I think we roll into the bottom, come up on these ledges up here, and uh, maybe run into that big billy again that we shot at. If not, we've got a couple other candidates that uh, are up in Mordor land in the cliffs. Let's see what they do. Ready to go up there? Got to get closer. Same. It's three o'clock, so if we go over there, it's definitely gonna be dark. Feel like we kill one or not. What's the Mandura for the plan? We gotta get up so I can see. up there in case he starts moving. when you're coming through that little opening. I was so for him. Oh, I'm try. He's right here. Does everyone 
really feel real after what we've been through. <laughs> sunset out there but I think that the rain is coming no fancy shots with the goat horns hanging out we just got to get home That's okay. we gotta get Fish tonight. Because if we are, that means we're getting the humpy out of the stream. <laughs> 